Hey, welcome back to another video. This is King Rancher 13. Uh, last night we got back from Houston pretty late. Um, had to work on another customer's 2020. And then picked up uh, this new trailer, 18 by 83 and has a removable side so I can put a four wheeler up in the front and then two and a half foot gate in the back. I was looking to get one that was maybe about $600 cheaper that had the full kind of gate on the side there. And after thinking about it, it was actually a lot narrower, narrower than I thought. And so I went ahead and spent a little bit more. Got this one for 2,300 before taxes and all that registration and stuff. But gonna take it out to the deer lease today before the hurricane moves in. I hope wherever y'all are at, the hurricane's not gonna get y'all too bad or anything like that. Here in Northeast Louisiana, we should be fine. We're just gonna bunker down, make sure we tidy up everything around the house. So if it's pretty windy, we'll be all good. Today, I got this customer's truck. He dropped it off on Sunday, but I haven't been able to get to it just because I've been going around so much. So he's had a exhaust issue that, um, is going on on their company truck and actually he's a previous customer of mine I don't know if you remember the black f-250 2016 or 15 one with the camper shell that's their company truck and so we love doing repeat business and uh, referral business so we appreciate everything y'all have been sending over to us if you don't know about us what we do is anything truck related uh, lifts wheels tires accessories exhaust you name it and we ship nationwide but if you want to have us do it give us a call but anyways go run a couple errands i gotta drop my bow off to make sure i get the strings ready for the season it might be a little too late because he said i think it's five weeks for um the strings to come in but you know we'll we'll see you know whenever it gets done I'm gonna do some work around and get check the mail and do all that kind of stuff but hope y'all enjoy this video uh, if you haven't already, please hit that like and subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. But we're going to get going with the day, see how this trailer pulls and how it rides with the Ranger on it, and come and follow along. Oh yeah, and by the way, yesterday when I was going to Houston and driving around there, I was getting 24.6 miles per gallon uh, on Lyo meter, um, going about 65 to 75 uh, with the cruise set. So hey, that's pretty good. That's better than what I thought in the last video. So I don't know how I always get to this point, but coming into the sporting goods store with my wallet is never good. But I haven't shot the one that I just showed you in the video right there yet. So I'm bringing in my bow to get restrung. And uh, of course I'm seeing all the new ones that are out of the Matthews of Hoyts, uh, trying to decide what I want to do. Getting it restrung is $130 and, um, and you know, it's an old, old, older bow, Parker bow. And then I'm looking at some of the other ones. They're about, you know, 600 to 1,000 bucks. Pray for me. All right, y'all, just pulled up to the hunt property. Brought my folks out with me. Um, so they're gonna go on a little ride on the Ranger. What be doing is showing them around the place and then also putting out some corn. <laughs>
got done working on the Cummins. But now we got this Cummins. Uh, I don't know how I'm gonna reach that, but we'll figure it out. Okay, so after all that, we're back at Spotted Dog. Dad, Dad, this way. And I reckon we're gonna go get this bow. So this is a Matthews Z7 Extreme. I think uh, Richard said it's about uh, three, four years old, something like that. And uh, he's considering getting one of the new ones. I forget what Matthews it was, but this is one that's already rigged out and everything. So I reckon we're gonna shoot it. And then if I like it, I'll get it. You need to walk it up. Oh, yeah, that's right. Y'all got it in the bank. <laughs> Which one did you get? Chocolate chip. Chocolate chip. Yeah. Name but one kind. <laughs> right, center that whole housing up, but you pin on what you want to get. You got checked out. Alrighty, so got this bow. What for... do you have today? Got us a used Matthews bow and just got it on trade or whatever. And... I don't know, it's, it's already set up to go, 600 bucks. Michael uh, he got me a free hat behind him. So, actually, I'm going to give that to my dad for being cameraman. <laughs> Thank you. Um, all right. But, anyways. All right, y'all, so we're back from doing all that running around and stuff. Uh, the hurricane's coming tomorrow or something like that, so you gonna get things ready around the house. You got the Ranger hooked up to the new trailer. You gotta move around back and <clears throat> make sure it's all secured and tied down and things like that. Then gotta get some things done in the office and then gotta get to working on the Star Max, hopefully by the end of the night. So, that's it for this video today. I know that it wasn't very much, but just wanted to show y'all the new trailer. Actually, I'll just go ahead and do a quick walk around of it. All right, so it's got one of those jack deals and that's how it fastens to the pitch. This is where the spare tire goes. But yeah, these are the removable sides on it. They come down, got lights on the side there. Got steak pockets here on the other side and steak pockets here as well. Tandem axle. And 
and then it's got a light for underneath on the tag somewhere. And then this has a little bit of dovetail. As you can see, it's kind of nice. And then to put the ramp down, you do is pull this up, turn like that, make sure it stays right there. Same thing on this side, pull it up, turn it, stay right there. Pretty good looking little trailer. Not bad for 2300. Back up. So I guess I don't know if we can lay this on. I guess technically you can lay that down too. I don't even think about it. Just line it up with the holes. Let's see if I can do this one hand. I do is just turn this a little bit. Just like that. So there's the trailer. Gonna go ahead and move things around. The wind's starting to pick up a little bit right now. But thanks so much for watching, y'all. If y'all have come this far, I'm gonna be uploading another video for Josh's truck. I promise it's coming. It's just that our schedules haven't been matching up. Oh yeah, and there's my finger that I almost chopped off. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, that was fun. Take care, guys. I hope I make it through this hurricane. Wish me luck. Reporting live from Columbia, Louisiana. This is your local Columbia weather. We're getting some winds, a little bit of light rain, about 25 miles per hour, something like that. Actually, I don't know how to tell how fast wind's blowing, so take it or leave it. But we're doing pretty good out here. But guys, make sure you're stocked up on food. Uh, I've got some Oreos if y'all need some. But hope y'all stay safe. Bye.